Hello everyone, and happy Halloween. This is Dark Ephemera, and welcome to my ASMR channel. This is where you and I are going to be looking at some interesting things, and especially since it's Halloween season, we'll be looking at wonderful Halloween items. First off, I have a new background. Ghosts. Little trees. All on a black background. Very festive. Very Halloween. So, we'll be looking at Halloween items. And first up is some brand new Tim Holtz wallpaper. This is Tim Holtz ideology worn wallpaper. Halloween 2020. This package contains two each of 12 designs. There's a little preview there, and also a preview on the back. Right, let's take a look at these. These sheets look to be 5 by 7. Let's look to see if the dimensions are on the package. Hmm. 5 by 8. Very good. 5 inches. By eight inches. It's a fairly sturdy cardstock. See that? If I get very close to it. Hmm. I always have such difficulty with the uh, focus texture. First one is this pale green and green stripes with a floral pattern. A little bit of the grungy dirt that you usually see in Tim Holtz things. We get two sheets. Could line it up to get an even bigger piece of paper. Good. 
next one's a little creepier. It's got some roses. Black and gray roses. It's a lot of crunchy dirt. Crunchy, very crunchy. up. Suppose we did that a little bit like that. A little bit of overlap, but it lines up nicely. Beautiful. Beautiful and creepy. This there's something about this that doesn't look like wallpaper at all. More like a fancy end paper. This one's less crunchy. Very pretty and spooky. <laughs> My goodness, this looks like something from the sixties or the seventies. The 1860s. This also looks too large to have a repeating pattern. Basically right on top of each other. Show where the repeating pattern is. Right there. Oh, now this one. This one has been in a previous Halloween set. I just recently used it in a project. And, uh, you can see the video on my channel. My biggest problem I had with this was I wasn't sure if it goes this way or this way because This way, it looks like a little creature with strange eyes. And this one, it 
this way, it looks like a little creature with even stranger eyes. I can't remember what direction I ended up choosing for my project, but I remember it debating quite a long time. And this has some wonderful sooty char around the edges as if it was burnt. The house was burnt down. And only the wallpaper remained staring deep into your soul. Anyway. Oh wow, look at this one. Something um, almost dimensional about it. There's no uh, dimension here, but I wonder if it's flocked or something in real life. Oh boy, what direction does this go in? It's giving me some creepy vibes here. I like it. This is cool. Blacks and grays. Very straightforward. sweet. A little strange to be in a Halloween packet. But it's very pretty. It has a slight oriental vibe to it. Roses, black and white flowers, vines, very painterly. Very nice. You can even um, cut this in half and make a border. Make a border piece. This pattern looks like something that would have been flocked in real life. With all the fading. faded, stained. Is that blood? It could be blood. This has a good overlap as well. That's 
24 sheets, 2 each of 12 patterns. Tim Holtz worn wallpaper. Halloween 2020. There's a good overlook of all of them. Colors are a lot brighter on these pictures than they are in real life, but yeah, I got the idea that this was purple, but not this bright. Mm. But still, it's nice. Tim Holtz. Tim Holtz's ideology line loves Halloween, and we love people who love Halloween. Well, that's it for uh, this video. Thank you for being here. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you had a relaxing time and got to see some spooky, wonderful Halloween wallpaper. So this is Dark Ephemera saying goodbye.